Adult educators need negotiation to benefit from the production and the distribution of the power. There is no doubt that once an adult educator involves in giving out the knowledge, the social systems such as politics, religions, society, culture, and diversity included as well. Education cannot operate by itself. It needs the contents so as we have something to teach and convey to other fellow human beings. So by taking sides, by being explicit about whom we represent and why we make clear the political and ethical dimension of our identity, we become visible by standing clearly for something. Quoted by Wilson in 2001. How do adult educators come into harmony? According to Wilson, to restructure relationships with learners and institutions and to constitute professional identity, we need the word negotiation. Negotiation is a way to see the problem. The problem may be one, for example, in specific programs, it is not meeting the standard of scientific legitimacy. Number two, unable to construct a recognizable professional identity could also be a problem of access and control that tie to creating the effective relations of professional power. Number three, unable to control who produces the knowledge. Why? Because this could lead to handicap in monopolizing the market for service. For example, the specific academic credentials, qualifying exams, licenses, certification, and other measures used strictly selecting who could monopolize the market, license nurses, license engineering, etc. Negotiation is used to unify, bring harmony among the participants so that or hopefully they will work together in such a conflictual world. One thing we need to do is, in today's society, the leadership to accomplish this negotiation has been lacking, according to Cunningham in 2001. That's all for my topic today. And finally, thank you very much for your participation, watching and listening. Until next time.